Hello, Smart Coalition members. We're going to communicate with you, with you through a video and see if this works to get more information out to you between meetings and encourage you to review uh, some of the data we've collected. We've spent tens of thousands of dollars collecting important data over the last year. We're going to review a few of those items today. Uh, one of the things we've collected is what's called a causal factor focus tool, kind of a weird word for basically saying we've taken all the data we collected over the entire year and summed it up into a few documents. We want to encourage you to read those documents so they don't go to waste and we keep them in mind when we're choosing our strategies. Because as we decide how to address alcohol abuse and prescription abuse, we need to use the data we've collected. So sit back, relax, and we're going to have a little role play here to show you um, some different things you can do, hopefully uh, read up on the, the literature that we've collected. So Becky, what can we be doing to prepare for the next coalition meeting? Well actually, Rachel, you as a coalition member can do two things. There are two steps. Step one is to read the causal factor focus tools. And where can you find those? You can find those on the website under the data collected tab or we will also send them to you attached to this email and the website address will also be included in the email for easy access. So Rachel, did you get a chance to read the causal factor focus tools? I did. That was great. There was some very important information in there. And those county employees, they are awesome with their data collection in it. <laughs> so step two, what is the second step? Second step would be to review the ideas list, which is found also on the website under the strategies tab. And that gives a lot of different ideas on uh, different prescription and alcohol uh, related uh, strategies or programs. After you've read the ideas list, we would like you to go ahead and narrow those ideas down to five to seven that you think might be best to address the prescription and alcohol problems that we have in our community. And we'd like to ask you to do this before next meeting so that we'll be prepared to move on in our task force. Becky and Rachel, thank you for doing the nice role play. Hopefully that made things clear on some things you could do between this uh, coalition meeting, which is next Tuesday in July. Uh, we'd appreciate it if you could do that. And um, so just a reminder, the first step is to review the causal factor focus tool. The second step is to go on the website, take a look at the idea list, and narrow down to the ideas that you think are the best. We're still going to be brainstorming into a coalition meeting as well. We're not down to, I don't think we have all the ideas brainstormed out yet, but we're trying to move the coalition forward and eliminate some of the ideas that we know we don't want to work on. So thanks for tuning in, and we're going to send out a survey after this to find out if you liked this video and if you'd like us to continue to communicate with you like this in the future. Thanks so much.